The Reese Museum is located on the campus of East Tennessee State University. Since 1965, the museum has displayed collections of art and local history. To celebrate ETSU's 100th anniversary, the Reese Museum designed the Centennial Exhibition, which documents the growth and change of the university. It will remain open until April 29, 2011, and features photos, videos, artifacts, as well as interactive history stations. Now, preferably, we would sit them down with a recorder and video them or tape record them. But we just, unfortunately, we don't have the staff to do that here at the museum. So we thought we would kind of do a compromise and make it more of a self-help kind of oral history station where they can sit down and they can type out their stories. And they, we also have a scanner at one of the stations so they can bring in their photographs. The Centennial Exhibit opened during homecoming festivities at ETSU. Joe Muse, a 1996 ETSU graduate, visited the Reese Museum with friends and fellow alumni to share memories of his college experience. We try to come to uh, homecoming when we get a chance. Uh, we saw online that they're doing an exhibit to scan in pictures from when I was here. So brought up several uh, to share with ETSU, some including Taylor Hall, which is no longer here. A potential ETSU student was also intrigued by the Centennial Exhibition. I really like the museum. I, I kind of like vintage stuff, so this is really, really fun. It's old and timey. Faculty members who may not be familiar with ETSU's history can also appreciate the Centennial Exhibit. I, I mean, I'm a history major from Dartmouth, and so I'm a big fan of uh, studying history. And I, I think it's great that we're kind of commemorating the as, as we go into the Centennial year to kind of look back at where ETSU's been and think about where we're headed. Local history has had an impact on the growth of ETSU. Faculty member Brandon Green recognizes the importance of both the Centennial exhibit and the history of country music in the Tri-Cities exhibit. I've uh, had the chance to uh, check the museum out and particularly I had um, strong ties to the, the room with all the uh, country and bluegrass and old time uh, music uh, displays and the kiosk and um, it, it, it reminds me of, of how deeply rooted the music that I enjoy, the culture that I enjoy really is. We're sort of like this little hidden treasure on campus. Um, even though we have a sign outside, you know, I guess people still um, overlook us to a degree. But I think people should come by, one, because it's a beautiful exhibit and it shows some really incredible pieces of ETSU history. But they should be stopping in at the Reese Museum every month or so 